so I told you why am I doing this. I recorded a clip on my camera, but I will just post it from here. So we are just doing fasted cardio because that's what's been added on to my regime. I feel okay besides being sweaty. Um, which I didn't think just walking is going to make me this sweaty. I guess it, it is on an empty stomach and yeah, I'll let's okay, go. So start. I made it to like a um, massive field and if I felt better, I'll probably start running. Uh, I might do it next time. I'm just really, really tired. So what I wanted to say is like, there's like a highway here. So that's why you probably can hear everything. So I feel every time I watch those girls that, you know, start a diet or start cutting or shredding, everyone like, oh, you know, they seem really, really chilled and everything is okay. And I only seen like two, three girls showing this actually a struggle. Like we all want to look fucking amazing. Sorry, can I swear or can I not swear? Like amazing. And you know, I've uh, never really tried diets before. Like I would... I won't really restrict my calories. I would like either change my habits from eating donuts and everything to eating like strawberries and you know, a lot of fruit, a lot of veg, but it doesn't get me where I want to get. So I did get myself a coach and so far so good. He is really nice. He's always there when I need something. He is quick reply. He is local as well. So um, next week we will probably do a session where I go in and just make sure that I engage my glutes every time I do some sort of exercise because that's my main goal and I feel like when I have to do a full body routine I just forget about it do you know what I will <sighs> just a sec my routine is basically full body on one day so I train there's like four exercises for legs for example I will be two chest, two back, shoulders, and some arms and abs. So we will do that, for example. And I feel like my brain just thinks like it needs to hurry up every time I do it. So I'll just make sure that my little booty does the work. So what I wanted to say, it was about dieting. So last, when was it? It was, I don't know, like mid what day would it be it's been like two almost three weeks into me dieting um and by dieting oh shit there's no road here okay so uh by dieting i mean i just basically kept my calories the same we just changed what i've been eating so from having high carbs we changed it to high fats so from for example instead of my oats i'll have like uh, almond butter and stuff and a lot of salmon a lot of like good healthy fats like avocados and stuff so that's what we've been doing in the first week was an absolute torture and i feel like it's not talked about uh people are like oh yeah the first couple of weeks of dieting is not that bad to me it was absolutely disgusting it was <laughs> Uh, totally different food that I eat on a regular basis. Totally different routine. I was doing cardio and I was doing um, HIIT and I was doing my regular workouts and I was like, listen, I just can't fucking do it. Then my anxiety went really, really high. And, and after that, I couldn't sleep. So all that on top, the second week was a torture again and there was a few bumps on my road. Um, for example, like I couldn't make it to the gym one day, the second day, like it was my refeed day. So I ate that really late. So then my weight was fucked up and I was like, listen, like I'm fucking stressing the fuck out now because I'm a kind of person, like if I see progress, like I wanted to keep on going down and I do know there will be bumps on my way, but I just don't want it to be. So we had a little chat and we did add... Uh, fasted cardio so this is what we are doing we're changing it up a little bit um when so why am i cutting i'm cutting because i i was really skinny when i joined the gym and i bulked up because i want the legs and i want a butt and i just want to be in shape i swear i'm like that's out of topic but i'm sweating so bad i feel like i didn't even have a glass of water 
yet. Um, that's why we're walking the longest way for, like possible through shop. Let me just do my shoes. So yeah, I just, I just want to see where I can, where I can be. So like when I joined the gym, I was really skinny, uh, really tiny. I would try to like post a picture or something for you to see. Um, and then I bulked up and all of a sudden, like I'm waking up and my tummy is still, you know, still don't look that bad. But I'm like, a, I call myself a potato. I'm so sorry for all the potatoes. Uh, like we, we all love them, but then, you know, we call ourselves one. And I just realized, I'm like, I'm not this lean. Like I want to have a nice like tummy, like toned, really nice hard body. Like um, Rachel, what's her name? I'll post her picture here. Um, you know, I might not be a competition ready in like five weeks or so, but I just wanted to see where I can get because I did plan on competing, but it is so hard. Um, I definitely still want to compete one. I still definitely want to compete one day. I would just like to see how it is. So that's my first cut. I never intentionally cut before. And because I'm lazy, like I swear, like I don't walk anywhere. I either take a bus or someone picks me up. Like even to work, I have like a massive hill. It's like one and a half thousand steps to get up the hill. But I'm always like, oh, I'm not doing this. Uh, so someone always picks me up from the bottom of the hill. And, you know, with the weather getting nicer, I just thought, why not do some, some good for myself? And yesterday it was my first fasted cardio day. So I did like Zumba with Carol Lachey. Well, it was like a dancing and abs with Carol Lachey. And today I was like, I'm tired, my legs are aching, and I still need to do sprints, so I'm just going to go walk. Um, and I still need to get a few things, which I thought I remembered what I had to get, but now I don't. I'm just hoping that everyone that just saw me, there was so many people, I'm like, it's nine o'clock, you should be all at work. Uh, but yeah, so a lot of the time, I don't know, I don't know if you, I don't even know what I'm talking about, like, I just, I'm out of it. Um, I mean. so yeah a lot of the time like you see people like oh first couple of weeks of dieting is nothing if you change your diet completely around like my calories are still the same I'm not going to maybe in some time I'll tell you what my calories like my my macros are one day I don't know if you guys want to know oh yeah my <laughs> my allergies are going to kill me now but they didn't change like they stay exactly the same just carbs were replaced with my fats and the change of the diet that just that just killed me so adjusting to this change took me a couple of weeks so now now i'm okay like i don't feel particularly tired having more fats than having carbs um, is my body more efficient? I don't know. It's been tired. So next week is going to be like a good, um, how would I call this? It would be like a good mark to see, you know, I adjusted to the diet. I adjusted to having high fats, low carbs, um, to see if I'm okay. How was my strength? Yesterday, my strength was really low, but I was feeling really tired. So see how the fasted cardio affects my routines and stuff like that hopefully not too much <sighs> i'm like out of breath and we've only did like not even 20 minutes um i'm aiming for 30 minutes uh in the morning if i'm going to go for a walk i'm trying to look for like little hills and stuff to walk over there is a lake close to here so maybe on Monday, which is my day off, we will try to get to the lake. I don't really know how to get there, but I'll get a GPS and we can do that. So uh, next week is going to be like a trial day. I'll try with this. I'll put one of my, I'll see if I have a footage to do one of my full body for you. And I'll pop it in here so you can see it. And yeah, you guys like make my walk a little bit nicer. So. If you guys want me to talk about something as I do my morning cardio, I feel like it's really nice to just go outside. I, I never ever go outside because I'm too lazy. I just, you know, there's so many things I could be doing. Like I could be in bed, I could be organizing, I could be eating, reading my books. 
but I'm listening to podcasts. So if you guys have good podcasts or audiobooks, let me know. I want to listen to uh, this one. I don't know. Amanda Bucci recommended it. So I might just do I To be honest, I have no idea what the fuck I am right now. It's like always this way my bus comes. But to walk it? No clue. Okay, so I'll see you guys when I'm in the store to show you what I get. It's Catch up in my head. It's gone down. Uh, be running the city like kings without a crown. You know him in my crew, girl. You just wanna play. I've been looking like, mmm, baby. Girl, what you say? You ain't find it when I'm done yet. I ain't done yet. And I'm swinging low like trumpets. And I come through your city. And I know that you love that. They gonna get it on when we drink it kind of flirty. If you see me talking to a man, you know we talking dirty. Girl, you the one I want to make. And if you want. Got much back, baby. You were going, we will come and make that ass clap. If you want that, I could give another ride and we could take the world to another side. Like it, girl. Be my it, girl. Looking like she could go and use a whip, girl. Like, play a little game if you want to work that. Oh, call it just a tip, girl. And I know about it, yeah. Baby, we could go and see. I'ma put a ring on it. Tell you if you marry me. Like, that's how we do it. I say we kick it like judo. I'ma drop it on the track like it was. Just under the low. Me. And if you want You ain't find it when I'm done yet, I ain't done yet And I'm swinging low like trumpets And I come through your city And I know that you love that They gonna get it on when we drink it kinda flirty If you see me talking to a man, you know we talking dirty Girl, 